Hey guys, Coldozer here, or Alex, with part 2 of the unique potential scroll event video that I uploaded not too long ago. So, hopefully you guys saw part 1, where I used the unique potential scrolls from the event on various items that I've needed to be unique for some time. And in this video, you'll see me um, cubing the items I unique and or along with another item that I already had unique, being my dagger. Now, instead of actually following along in the video and telling you guys what cubes I used on which item, or how many cubes I used on uh, an item, or the end results, I've actually decided that I want to go on a little tangent and tell you guys how I actually started Maple. So, without further ado, let's get right into it. So, it was a nice summer evening, the air was crisp, the sun was dulling, and I was bored out of my mind <laughs> until one reckless moment that would change my life forever happened. The moment my cousin told my brother and I about the hip and funky fresh new game on the block called Hello Kitty Wonderland. Hell yeah! <laughs> actually, no, I'm just kidding. Um, it was actually Maple Story. Dun dun dun! Aw, shit. <laughs> but yeah, um... <laughs> Now, uh, some of you actually may be wondering or thinking to yourself, but Alex, but wait, which maple story? And that, my friends, will forever remain a mystery until part 3. <laughs> no, I'm just messing with you guys again. But, um, well, um, I, well, most of my brother, guys, are, um, started off on KMS or Korean Maple Story. And I say my brother mainly because he was the one who would usually be on because we only had one computer at the time. And this was like 11 years ago, give or take, I think, pretty sure. And uh, this was back when I was only 8, holy poop. Damn, does time fly by. But, um, well, after some time of playing Maple, we slowly got bored and took a break until about uh, two years later when GMS came out. And uh, now, to be honest, Maple is something that we both had forgotten during that time that we had a little break. And um, until shortly after, our childhood friend actually um, introduced us or told us about the game again, in which case we remembered it. So we began, we began to play again, rekindling the dusty old relationship we once had with the game, and life went on. Uh, real life friends tagged along for the journey, but as time went on, uh, we went our separate ways. Pretty much all of them quitting, until one stood atop, victorious, one man to rule them all, Alex the Great! Oh, oh my god! <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I'm actually gonna be quitting soon, too. Just kidding! <laughs> uh, but, um, that pretty much is my story of how I started. Um, yeah. If you guys. Oh, um, I guess I should mention this, but. I. When I actually started Maple, or creating Maple Story. My brother and I both actually played on the same account, and we both played a warrior. And in GMS, he stuck with warriors, I stuck with um, thieves, or I switched to thieves pretty much. And the first thief I made was a hermit, because I loved the idea of Shadow Partner, and I loved that they could fast jump. <laughs> like, that, those were my main reasons, really, why. But yeah, um. That's pretty much it. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed, and I know that I did. <laughs> and um, yeah, thanks for watching, uh, and take care. Oh, and I realized that the commentary is not as long as the video length is footage, so uh, you guys probably heard music along with the background, so um, hope you guys just enjoy that. and. Enjoy watching me cubing my dagger for some good potential. Alright, <laughs> thanks for watching, and take care. <laughs>